welcome back! Today is going to be a different kind of video, I have to say, because today I'm going to do a makeup unboxing. Now, disclaimer, first of all, this channel is not turning into a beauty channel at all. I just purchased some makeup items recently and the box has arrived and I wanted to share it with you. Also, I think it's kind of nice to sometimes have some different videos up on your channel. So this is what this is. Here is the box and it contains four makeup items that I'm very excited about. Now I will have to say first of all, I'm not a makeup guru. I don't know a lot about makeup, hence this purchase. Because the past year I have been watching a lot of channels about beauty and about makeup. That has gotten me curious to try it out myself. I have been wearing makeup for the past many years, but that's basically been like foundation, concealer and mascara and that's it. After having watched all of these videos, I have been curious to experiment a little bit more and try out some new products. Let's just get cracking with the scissors. I apologize in advance for all of the boys out there because this may not be a video for you, but I promise that my next video is going to be a book video and it's probably going to be my May wrap up part two. Let me just get this box cracking and I'm very very excited I don't normally purchase makeup online but this time I did so times are changing or something okay we have some pink paper it is all wrapped in pink I love that Books aren't wrapped in pink. They should be, I think. So let me start with the very first item that I grabbed. And this is the reason why I did this purchase. And that is the Naked Decay. Naked Decay. <laughs> that just goes to show that I'm not at all an expert in this makeup thing. But this is the Urban Decay Naked Palette. This is what it looks like. It's very pretty, but I believe it's even prettier inside. Let me see. And... This is eyeshadows, if you don't know, and it has a lot of eyeshadows in it, so I'm very curious to see them for myself and play with them. So this is the box. I think it's very pretty. It's actually made of this kind of velour, is that what it's called? So I didn't know that, but I guess that's, I guess that's fancy. Anyway, here is the eyeshadows. Wow. They're actually quite pretty in person. Or a little bit brownish. I thought there would be more colors but I guess this is perfect because if I do wear eyeshadow then I would wear neutral brownish colors. I don't know if that's the right shade for my eye color. My eyes are very blue but that's what I normally go for so this is perfect. So we have a lot of different eyeshadows. Looking at it right now I would say that Sidecar is definitely pretty and let me see Smog sounds interesting. Toasted also is very pretty. And Hustle and Gun Metal. Can you see this? But definitely very pretty eyeshadows and I'm, I'm so excited to play with these. My plan is to try out this palette by watching some makeup tutorials that are online because I have watched a lot of tutorials on the Naked palette and it looks stunning and I would never be able to do these beautiful eyeshadows compilations myself so these tutorials are perfect and I'm definitely going to try and play with this. Next item is a mascara and I do know this mascara because this is my go-to mascara. This is Helena Rubinstein's Lash Queen Mascara Feline Blacks Waterproof. Basically this is the best mascara I've ever tried yet and that's why it's my go-to mascara. It's good for both evening wear and everyday wear I would say even though it does give you a very long lashes and very black lashes I think it's good for everyday wear also at work because it does make your eyes stick out in a good way and I really like this mascara so I had to get one of these as well. Next we have a very interesting item and that is this. This is supposed to be an eyebrow pencil. I've never tried this before. This is going to be totally new for me I don't know if that's embarrassing to say, but that's how it is. I don't wear a lot of makeup. It's very well wrapped. It's almost impossible to get out. It's quite annoying, actually. This one is from Benekas. Benekas, can you see? And it's a natural eyebrow 
designer. It says it's a gentle brown and it has both a brush for your brows as well as the actual pencil. I took a chance with this one because I had no idea what color I needed for my specific brows. So I decided to go for this gentle brown and I don't know if it will work out or not, but I am going to play with it like with all the other items. And the very last thing I got are some makeup brushes from Real Techniques. Now, Real Techniques is the brand that a lot of makeup channels talk about when it comes to brushes. So I decided to go for this starter set because I am a kind of a new beginner within makeup. So here we have some brushes. We have five in total and I believe they are all for the eyes. And that's perfect because I do have brushes for my blush and powder. So I basically just needed some new eye brushes. So this is perfect. And that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I definitely have some new items to play with now. I don't think I'm ever going to do a makeup tutorial on this channel because as I was saying, I have no expertise within makeup. So that would be kind of silly for me to do. But maybe I will turn up in a video someday with some eyeshadow and some great mascara and then you know where it comes from. I hope you enjoyed this kind of different video. I will be back again soon with a bookish related video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day everyone. Bye bye!